All right. We got a cutscene, bro. This is sick. Defenders of Seoul. Hear me now. Moments ago, one fire team infiltrated the witness's monolith. The world's first. And shattered its hold on the traveler's light. Their courage bought us one last chance to finish this. This is so sick, dude. But the witness still lives. The guardians and their ghosts will face. Everybody's the here, bro. Wait, what? This is so dope. While we eliminate the remainder of its forces. This is like some end game type stuff. And freedom. Sabathoon's here too. Lies on that field. This enemy has taken so much from us all. Helix knee. Cabal. Awoken. Humanity. Hive. The witness started this war long ago. Dude. Now, we end it. He has stasis? What? Wait, Zavala lost his light, but he's he's able to wield darkness. Because oh, <laughs> wait, that's sick. Bro lost his light, so he doesn't need the dark. Wait, 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 wait. So he doesn't have his light anymore, <laughs> but he's he's able to channel the darkness still, because that's part of the guardian. It's able to. It's it's like prismatic, right? Being able to use both. Oh my god, this is so sick. Wait a minute. <laughs> Okay, so, so the world's first, actually, I think it took 18 hours. So the raid came out on Friday, right, Salvation's Edge, and the world's first team got it in 18 hours. There's only been one clear. As of this recording of the video you're watching, only one team has beat the raid, and it's been 18 hours in. It's been past the 24-hour window now, and only one team has beat it still. I don't know how many teams are going to beat it after 48, but currently at 24 hours... The first team beat it at 18, and that's it. There's only been one team who beat it for Worlds First in 24 hours. So they would have been it. They would have been the only team so far. But because of the 48-hour window, it got pushed over. And because they beat it, now we have access to this mission, which is 12 players, apparently, which is awesome. That's only happened once in a bug. There was a, there was a bug in Glassway back in Beyond Light. That allowed like a 12 player nightfall, which was really cool. Everybody wanted it and they got rid of it. So, this is the first official 12 player activity in Destiny. <clears throat> and I'm excited because obviously <laughs> I wasn't able to do freaking the raid and beat it. We got to second encounter and it was tough, man. <laughs> Getting to second encounter and the raid was tough. Um, it was fun. I think Salvation's Edge is one of the. Probably the best raid Bungie's ever made. Considering Last Wish was the second hardest, or was the first hardest, I guess. Even after a power creep, I think Salvation's Edge takes it over. Like, it is it is probably the most difficult raid for a contest. Obviously, after contest, it's probably going to be a lot more doable. But I think it is the hardest contest we've had since La Last Wish. I'm pretty sure Salvation's Edge was longer than Last Wish at this point. Which is crazy. Um... So that's cool. That is cool. Uh, only one team cleared it in 24 hours. That's insane, dude. And they unlocked this awesome uh, mission, or I guess activity. It's a 12-player activity from what it says. I only see six ships, so I want to see how it's going to be for 12. We need to get eyes on the witness. First fire team in there, don't hesitate to engage. <laughs> this is so sick. I've never, dude, this is like a full-on crucible team. This is so sick, dude. This we, is what we were made for. Oh, we're already dead. <laughs> we got three of us are dead. Let's test how strong your logic truly is. Oh my god, this is so cool, dude. We have light guardians, we have we have the freaking hive, Mithrax, Sabathu, 12 guardians. 
Kaido the Cabal? Dude, this is endgame. This is literally endgame. This is actually so sick. What? Oh my god. Reach the witness. Territory zero out of four claimed. All right, we got this, guys. I'm healing you. I'm healing you. I'm healing you. Okay, so we're fighting the Vex, Taken, and I guess some of the Legion, Shadow Legion from Witnesses. The Witnesses group, I guess. Okay. I'm just gonna... Oh, I probably should stay. I should do the objective. Let the team... Let everybody else do everything else. You know what I mean? Let the... Uh, our allies focus on the enemy. Okay. Bro's name is Foremost Yapper. That's funny. Okay. One out of four. Okay, so we got to claim all the territories. Got it. That's fine. We, we can do that. Oh, my God. The music is so sick, man. This is cool. Grenade Launcher. What a name. All right. We got this one, it looks like. All right. We need, we need two more. We need two more. Dude, our damage is nuts. Tw I have never seen 12 players all in one area. This is so freaking cool, man. <laughs> nice, good noble bomb. Everyone heal, everyone heal. Everyone over here. Oh man, look at it. It looks like we can even heal our uh, our allies as well. Not the guardians, but like we can heal Mithrax. And oh, we got someone behind us. <laughs> this is where a ping system would be crazy good in this game. But look at that, our damage is crazy. <laughs> 12 guardians. Oh, this witness is, he's smoked. This is a change of pace, isn't it? Uh huh. Never let it be said I wasn't here when it counted. <laughs> I got you, Mythrox. I'm healing you, bro. Okay, Tormentor. Oh, he's oh he's cooked. Oh, the Tormentor's cooked. Nah, almost, almost. Nice. Good job, everybody. I don't know if a sword is good for this, but I'm hoping. All right. We're, we're all in here. Everything's good. Everything's fun. I'm going to lower the audio a little bit. I want to hear um, and the music. I want to hear the dialogue mostly. Because <clears throat> the cutscene. This is really cool, though. Okay. I don't think a sword is to play here, dude. I'm going to be honest. I'm probably going to put on like a grenade launcher. We'll do this. Okay. Nice. Good job. Nice. We'll do, Zavala. We'll do. Witness forces are closing in. Help me stop them. Oh, that's so sick, dude! Oh my God, that's so cool. Vanguard command. We're closing in on the witness now. This is it. Oh my God, we're actually we in. We are the first knife. We are the edge that carved purpose into being. Your resistance will be remembered. Within the shadow of the Black Fleet. Oh, this is so sick. The Saint arrives to offer aid. Saint 14? Bubble? Nice. Thank you, Saint. I'll take the weapons of light. My king. Oh, we need prismatic? Easy. Boom. Oh, my God. This is so... So, like, is there a mechanic here? We have to have a mechanic for this, I would assume. Oh, my God. Okay. Slay the witnesses. Cornerstone, let the light pour forth. Cornerstone slain. Okay, we gotta kill these guys first. That's the that's the first objective. If it's like the raid, or the raid mechanic, that's gonna be interesting. With 12 people. This is so cool, bro. 12 people in one mission. It is laggy, though. It is incredibly laggy. I don't, we've never seen 12, 12 players in an area, so I honestly, I can't blame the game. It's trying to register everything at the same time. Which is kind of funny. <laughs> That's fine. It's dead. It's dead. We're good. We're good. Everyone good. Everyone good. I'm healing you. I'm healing you. All right. I got unrending darkness. I don't know if that's a buff. Excuse me, buddy. 
Alright, here, let's go back to Saint. Get the bubble. Oh, there's heavy right there. Oh, I'm not gonna grab it. I'm not gonna grab it. Oh my god, why did it take like three seconds for it to get it? I didn't see it, so that's my fault. I got 17 bullets in the mag though. I got 17 in my edge transit, so we're okay. We'll be alright, we'll be alright. <clears throat> alright. Dead. Corner sounds dead. What is this? Oh, ooh! Draw from the Trevor's light. Okay. Not sure what that does. Facet of protection. I think that's the that's a buff. Mmm. Use it in the elegant ways to which your guardians are so accustomed. That's so freaking sick. I don't know what this does. We got a relic sword. Oh, it's a rift? Light gathered. What? Draw. Light undying? Okay, do I take it over here? Oh, dude, this is so dope, bro. Nah, this activity? This is, they cooked. Bungie literally cooked with this. Not only was the campaign fantastic, but a freaking 12 player activity, Avengers Endgame style, is, is peak. Like this is like a, a perfect ending to like a 10 year story chapter, dude. Oh man, I'm so excited to see what happens next, man. Oh man, the hat animation is creepy. Okay. Got that. Can I grab multiple? Okay. I'm away, teammates. I'm away. Heal, 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 heal. I got you. Boom. All right. Now we need two more, it looks like. Okay. I'll grab this one. I think I, did I not grab it? I, I thought I did. Unless I did the, the... No, I did. It's just really laggy right now. Okay. That's fair. There's a lot going on. You do not matter. Oh, we injured him. Part of his head is orange now. Just like the last oh. time, Guardian. Destroy the statues. Oh, are we going in? Free us. Free us. Embrace Free the us. darkness. Embrace the darkness. We are one. Oh, we just, can, we, can we just go slap all the... Oh, no way. That's so sick, actually. We just go and slap all the all the statues. That's so cool. We're gonna destroy all the statue. Damage! It's damage time! It's damage time! Everyone, get up! Go! 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 Damage! 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 Nice! Good job, teammates! All right, he's gonna hurt us! Oh! Damage! 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 It's transit! It's transit! Boom! He's doing the triple mechanic. Oh! It's the rain mechanic! <laughs> heal! 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 <clears throat> heal! 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 It's his hand thing. It's his hand. Wherever he slaps, he's gonna do damage. Look at the beam. Look at the beam. He's on the right. So move to the left. Okay. He's on the right. Move to the right. Move to the right. Oh! Heal! 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 Oh my god! I didn't know we we're gonna have to do range damage to this guy. Okay, he slapped us. We are the first we need, I need to change my damage, bro. Be cut. Hammerhead, maybe. Healing rifle's good. I'll break, maybe. Cartesian. Finished. Yeah, there we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. That's, I like this a lot more. Uh, I'm going to put my reload on for outbreak. Uh, kinetic, kinetic, kinetic. All right, cool. This is good. This is good. Now I'm ready. Hammerhead mostly just for Acclair, and then Outbreak for the DPS. Low-key, Outbreak has never been a failure, man. Especially with the credit version, it's kind of goaded. Oh my, oh, it is laggy. All right, it's fine. Break his shoulders. Oh, that's so cool, bro. I like this. So, for those who haven't done the raid yet, <laughs> that Witness DPS is how you fight the Witness in the raid. For the fifth boss, I believe. Like, he's the final boss, obviously, in the raid. So, it's the same mechanic, except... Here, you would have to destroy part of his hands. Oh, you actually... Wait, you actually do destroy his hands here. Oh, okay. So, destroying his hands do, does something. No idea what it does, but... It it either summons something or weakens him. Because in the raid, you have to, like... 
shoot his hands to get like a buff to spawn. And then you use that buff to shoot the things in the middle. But here it's kind of like you break the, uh, you go into the darkness to destroy uh, the, the veiled statues to do damage. Oh my God, this is so cool, man. All right, I'm gonna say I'm I'm saving I'm waiting for uh, damage to do Song of Flame. Okay. Now we just transfer light. Look for a spear. Yes, Saladin. <laughs> Thank you. Okay, do that. This is not like a a thing. It just kind of like I have light on dying. There we go. It's just taking away for it to register. Nice. <clears throat> Rift. Got you, Minotaur. Dead. Good. Grabbing the buff. Okay. This is cool, man. So we have Sabathun giving us the <coughs> her her swords. Then we got the Tenethic Spear from Kaido. Oh, man. I like how Saint's just here giving us a bubble 24-7. This guy is a real one, dude. Is giving us weapons of light 24 7. Real. This is cool. This is good. Uh, enough, enough, enough. I probably could put on the Golden Gun Sniper for damage, but I want to see how much I'll break. Go, go, go. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. This is so cool, dude. This is so cool. Over here, over here, over here, over here. Boom. Boom. Nice. Good damage, dude. We're going to... Good. Ammo, 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 ammo. All right, all right, all right. It's time. Oh, I don't... Oh, I, I don't have my super for this. That's... Per okay. I'm doing 4,000 a shot, and then I'm doing... I'll break it pretty good here, too. Pack Hunter? Oh, probably we're in the gallery. Honestly, that's my fault. I should have jumped away. That was 100% my fault. Okay. Everyone go back in. Everyone go back in. Oh. Holy crap. I probably should put on a linear. What am I doing, bro? A linear would be super good here. Oh. Excellent creature. Oh, I can do microcosm too. We're not done. Microcosm could work. I want to use a golden gun sniper, but I feel like microcosm, we're getting infinite heavy. Might as well use this, right? Maybe I heal that, and then I use this for damage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There's so many different builds I'm trying out right now. Ooh. Okay. I want to use a linear, but like the new trace rebel could do insane damage. You never know, right? It's a 12 player activity, so the damage is definitely tuned to 12 players. I think it's pretty balanced. I think they did a good job in the balancing. It's not like we one shot him, it's actually taking time. Oh, we can get prismatic from that too. Nice. Okay. <laughs> Go over there, destroy the cornerstone. <clears throat> okay. I think I'm gonna get the heavy this time. Oh, I got it. Cool. 360. Nimbus. Guardian, watch for their move. My assistance comes to you soon. Don't cut yourself now. What is this? What am I doing? I've never used that before. What was that red thing? It looked like I was, I was like marking an area to do damage, but I couldn't tell. Okay, I'm just gonna do the uh, the light thing. Stick to what I know. Okay, there we go. Ooh. Oh my god, there's so much over there, bro. Hole. So yeah, we can't cast super over there, so I might as well cast it now. Boom. Oh, this is sick, dude. I got you, teammates. I got you, I got you, I got you. Boom. Okay. Grab the light. Already grabbed that one. We only need, oh, we only need one more. We only need one more. Somebody's, okay, someone's already done it then. Okay. Cast you out. Not yield. 
Go, 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 go. Oh my god, this is sick. We're literally just breaking the witness one by one, dude. This is awesome. What a voices severed. What a what a cool activity, man. Actually insane. All right, damage time. All right, no super. All right, macrocosm time. There it is. That's our shot. All together now. Let's hit it. Good. Oh my god. Oh, that this is way better, dude. I'm gonna uh, not ADS this because I want to see where the hands are. Right side, right side, right side. Move, teammates. Oh, what? Was I was I in it? Oh, it's because the hands behind us. We gotta destroy the hands. Okay, there we go. Ah! Oh! I was trying. I'm just trying to destroy the hands. That way, people would get focused on the DPS and not get rolled. Okay. Cool. Broke the hands. Our DPS is right there, bro. We literally have the DPS. I got your teammate. Wait, wait. Good. Now. Oh, we're doing. Oh, we're, we got him. We're gonna get him to the last center right here, dude. We're so close. We're so close. We're so close. We oh. Final stand. Final stand. Final stand. You show that shape, it ain't fun. Call to ghost? What was made can be unmade. What? I know what to do. Don't, dude, don't tell me he sacrifices himself. Guardian, channel the traveler's light through me. I'm ready. What? <laughs> no way. Nine, 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 nine damage, bro. That was sick. I, I don't understand. Okay, my ghost isn't destroyed yet. We're good. Thank God. Oh, I got so scared. That's it. We oh. did it. Ah. Uh. We, we did it. Oh my god. Oh my god, dude. What an activity. That was so sick. Oh my god, we literally used the light from our ghost to create like a beam. Wait, he's good, right? He's hurting. We just got repaired the little guy. Dude. Don't break. Please don't blow up. Oh, we lost our light. No. Oh, he's not no. dead. He's not dead. There's no way he's not dead. There's no shot. I think he's just out of juice. He's like a battery. We got to recharge him. We just got to recharge him. I'm not coping, dude. He's a, he's a rechargeable bat. Ghost? Not the music, bro. No, please, dude. No. God, dude. You raised an army. You can bring back one ghost. Cade? He sure shined bright back there, huh? Cade? What comes from the light returns to the light. My gal Sundance told me that. She also said we're all connected. Guardians, ghosts, the Traveler. Oh, that's Sundance.
Now you tell the others this was my choice. My light. He's gonna go into my ghost? Nobody makes my fate but me. You're my favorite. Don't ever forget that. No! Guardian. There you are. <sighs> I don't know what to say. I don't... <sighs> Damn. Damn. So, I knew we weren't going to lose Ghost, because that's just like, there's no shot. But I didn't think we were going to... We lost Cade twice! Oh, I, man, it's you just... definitely healing. Oh, we got a new haircut. We still got a lot of work to do. Well, at least Surviving he got a new haircut. Witness forces, clashes with the Lucent Brood. It's a new generation, man. So much change. We've been fighting <coughs> this so long. And now we've won. I thought it would feel different. Well, maybe because we haven't celebrated it yet. D1 music, man. Guardian, Ghost, you're just in time. Tell them. At least our drip looks good. <laughs> Cade wouldn't let a little work get in the way of having a good time. <laughs> you're right. For now. Okay. <laughs> Our task is appreciating this moment. And after that? We'll face the future when it comes. God, do that music score, man. Oh, man. What a game, man. What a what an expansion, dude. Dude, I can't believe we got Cade and we lost him again. But he's with us forever now because he's a, he's a, he's a, he's the light in our ghost. Roll credits. Destiny 2. Dude, I... <laughs> That's... Insane. Actually... In... Is there another cutscene? What? From the very beginning, man. That's where it all started. A 10-year journey. Archie. Anna and Elsie.
DDZ. Saladin. Keitel. That's funny. We're on the, the that's the moon. Brimming City. Osiris and Saint. That's so nice, man. It's just a journey. It's just our journey. That's Chrome. He's taking a new leaf of the Hunter Vanguard. They're learning. Okay, Ikora and Zavala are learning darkness. Strand and uh, Stasis. <laughs> Exer with Star Wars? <laughs> That's cool. <laughs> Drifter and Eris, of course, of course. Morrow's with Crow, good. It's, it's like a new generation, man. That's insane. Amanda, I think, yeah, and her, oh, and the go, and his ghost. Oh, and it was his wife. Bum bum bum. It's the it's a new it's the new vanguard. Crows of all Ikora. Cause, dude, Cade, man, but Cade's it, is like, he's with us with the with the ghost, man. He's like the light within us. Wait, is that the Vex at Veil safe? Is that is that the new is something new? Teasing? Aramis and Varix, maybe? Spider? The Fanatic? Oh that's Aramis. So that's the other one with probably Mithrax. Sabathun. We have Zivu of Wrath still! We still have Zivu of Wrath. Damn. What a... What a story, dude. What... A story. Bungie, okay. I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna pronounce that, because <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna butcher it. It's... This is what Bungie does when, when they did Halo. They put, like, a very... Like, a thank you at the, at the very end. What is that? Are those like stars? The witness's death spread like a shockwave through its troops. The instant it was destroyed, things shifted. Most of the witness's followers fled when it fell, but its most zealous believers are still carrying out its last orders. Zivu Arath is still out there. Right, that's what I thought, yep. Moving in the shadows. Mm -hmm. How salvation is turned on itself with Aramis nowhere to be seen. <clears throat> mm -hmm. Savathun and the Lucent Brood are trying to claim control of the Pale Heart. Of course, of course. The witness dead. Both Scorn and Taken are directionless. That's, that's true. Simply, in the wake of the witness, a power vacuum has been created in the universe. Who knows what will try to fill it. But out of all of this, the most worrying thing is an aurora. It's bleeding out of the traveler. Light and darkness venting into open space over Earth. We designated a no-fly zone within 100 kilometers of the aurora, enforced by Alliance cruisers. Mm. So far, no one has tested it. Okay. During the initial formation of the aurora, a piece of anomalous matter erupted from the Traveler, moving away at relativistic speeds. We tracked one out to a distance between Neptune and Jupiter in the orbital path of Nessus. Then we lost That's track probably going to be the first episode. We've got hunters in the field. That's the first episode. We're going to go to Nessus. Thank you, Crow. I'll leave it to you. 
Copy that. I'm headed back out to the field myself. I... need to see if I can pick up Fickrel's trail. Find out what's going on with the Scorn. Sure. Keep me updated. And... good work. Damn. I assume that's it, right? We just we just pretty much stay here in space now. Cool, <coughs> dude. <coughs> what what a video game. It's actually like insane how a ten year journey has like led to this moment. We started back in twenty fourteen and D one in the Cosmodrome, right? We started off figuring out, oh cool, this is a new looter shooter, dude. Wow, people made people who made Halo made this. Wow. And then, you know, first DLCs, right? Like, we had, all right, Dark Below, House of Wolves, Taken King. Like, that was good. Then you D2 came out. I was like, all right, Red War, Red War was good. Then we're like, oh, cool. What else can they do? Damn, we got Ice, Stasis in 2020, Beyond Light. They're cooking. Then they set out the roadmap, right? Oh, Witch Queen was peak, right? Then we had Lifefall. We got Strand. That was good. And now this, dude. Ten years. We figured out the witness back in Shadow Keep 2019 when we did the Shadow Keep DLC. We went to the Black Garden and we saw a vision of ourselves talking to ourselves saying we are your salvation. And then this this week we literally fought the witness in the campaign. Then we fought him in the raid and then we killed him in the 12 player activity. You know what that means? It means that Bungie's capable of doing 12 man activities in the future. So whatever lies in Head of Destiny, there could be a 12-man raid. You know how crazy that would be? A raid with 12 people? I would love to see more 12-player activities, right? But this is a good start. This is like a testing zone. 12? We had everyone with us, dude. All the factions, all the races, all teaming up against the Witness. That was such a satisfying feeling. <laughs> and then they hit us with the emotional impact at the end, where we almost lose our ghost. But then Kate sacrifices himself to the light and then turns his light into the power source for our ghost. So Crow was able to bring him back, but I guess he wanted a peaceful death. Which means we're only we only got Kate for one expansion. We only got Kate for the pale heart. We only got him for this. He's not I don't I don't think Kate's gonna come back. But it was it was nice seeing him return uh, one more time to finish things off. What a conclusion, man. I don't know what's gonna be next for Destiny. We have Zavala with no light. But he might have darkness now. Ikoras allows her ghost. And then we have a new hunter vanguard, which is going to be Crow. And that was, the, that was what they were probably setting up at the beginning with Aldrin. <sighs> there, there's so much I could say about the story. But I think Destiny just happens to be one of those once-in-a-lifetime video games that you don't get to play as much, right? It's a, it's, it's a game you start from the very beginning. And it's been 10 years. So being able to play a video game for 10 years and seeing the story wrap up is so satisfying because you were there from the beginning right whether you started it from 2014 where you just played it you know a month ago or whatever for into the light it's just like being able to see a video game continue for so long and have a satisfying ending is really hard to pull off right a lot of movies right i guess the the, the biggest example was like avengers right avengers endgame that was that was like the example we had right there where we had everyone fighting for one good cause against the witness. And that was really cool, right? That felt like a climax. And this, and I would say the, the expansion did this. Um, and that was a satisfying ending. Obviously, who knows what what's next to come in Destiny. But I think this is probably their best expansion they've ever done. Like, I was a Taken King Glazer for the longest time. And I, and I love Taken King. I think that's what made Destiny peak. That was like prime. Right? You know, Forsaken was the peak for Destiny 2. But I think the the culmination of all that story buildup, lore, and the delay was worth it. Like, if this came out in, in February, I wouldn't know how much content they would have had or how much how good it would be. But, but who, besides that, the delay, for whatever reason, was worth it. Because this expansion was fantastic. The campaign was good. The, the planet is, is fun. The raid was very difficult. I couldn't believe that <laughs> only one team cleared it in 24 hours. Going back to Rudo Nightmares last year, there was so many day one clears. Our team did it in eight hours. And it was a good raid. We were, we were just really powerful and it was really easy, right? 
And it was still a fun time, but a lot of people didn't. So from them to do like a freaking last wish where only one team cleared it in 24 hours, and who many who knows how many is going to be in 48? Maybe probably less than 100. We'll see. The more people, as more people figure it out, I think they did a fantastic job with the expansion. I think Final Shape was literally perfect. They did. They did. Good. I I don't know what else they could have done. It, it's it's that good. And I think that's like my conclusion because there's nothing else I they needed to add. Like they did everything. All the stories, all the lore, everything was just worth it. All the build-up was just fantastic. And this this was great. What a what a fantastic journey. Truly. From being able to do the beta in Destiny 1, testing the game out, to being able to finish it is insane. And now if I, I assume if we go to the Pale Heart, I don't know if Kate's still there. Oh my god, Kate's not there anymore. So he was there for... That's why you had to do the wild hunt. He's still going to be in the campaign. Because that's how that works. The campaign, K will still be there. But he's not interactable there anymore. He's gone. It's actually done. This is probably like a... A finale thing. Return to Ghost to the Lost City. Here, let's go do that real quick then. And then we'll, uh, it will actually, we'll actually finish the campaign. Um... That's great. That that makes so much sense. That's why they wanted you to do the wild heart quest for the campaign, because they you needed to get his his sniper. That way we have a Cade weapon, because you wouldn't be able to do the quest after the conclusion. That makes so much more sense. I was like, why do I have to do this exotic quest specifically? Is it a bug? Nah, bro. It's because he's gone. He he sacrificed himself for this. He's not there anymore i want to see what ghost says before we uh, end the video here we're all connected cade Light. mine cade's he sacrificed his light so mine could shine again that's crazy i can feel him still sundance too i think taj all the ghosts and guardians who are a part of the traveler the witness wanted to provide purpose to the universe, but purpose is ours to choose. Our fates are ours to make. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Kate decided his was to reunite us. My king, now man. Get to ask the question the witness wouldn't allow anyone to. What do you want our future to be? That's deep. <sighs> Dude, this guy has been on my side the entire time, man. The witness is gone, but so is Kate Six. If I always like to restore your ghost, he bet it all on you. Still, ghosts can feel Kate's presence. It is still, uh, though he and every other ghost and every other garden that came before you are connected by Trevor's light. Witness ought to give meaning to the universe, but Kate has shown you that meaning, like fate, is yours to choose. Guardians make their own fate. His last act was to ensure that you and your ghost will have a future together in a way that he and Sundance could not. What will you do with it? And that's it. That's the campaign. It's peak. It's cinema. It's cinema. I now I've completed the final trip campaign. Oh man, he's not here anymore, bro. That's crazy, dude. There it is. I got my pin. I did it. I beat the campaign. Complete the final trip campaign. Let's go. Two more loadouts. We're so back. That's sick. Oh my god, dude. We did it. I don't have it anymore. That, that was the expansion. That was peak. That was good. I, 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 I literally think that was the best expansion in Destiny 2 they've ever done. And I, I want to say in Destiny in history. Because obviously it's the one, like, I can't say that all the other expansions were bad. Because all of that build up led to this moment. <clears throat> but I think this is the, the best they could have ever done, dude. This was literally the best they could have done. And I think that was... I think that was just perfect. Um, and I really, really enjoyed um, the expansion. And I think the, the story of Destiny in general was just peak. And I have no idea what the future of Destiny is going to look like going forward. Um, but I'm excited. Whether it's a Destiny 3 or another crazy big evil. But Destroying the Witness was cool. That was such a sick boss. 
and I'm excited to see where Destiny goes next. So that was a really fun activity. 12 players is nuts. And what a what a cutscene, dude. What a way to end it. There's there's so much you could say, but like it, it's just what a good experience. What a what a video game. You know? For those who played Destiny from the very beginning, played it whenever they can, or just were able to beat it. It's something that video games can do that like invoke so much power. It's such a good media. Right, movies, you could only convey so much in two hours, three hours. <laughs> this was 10 years in the making. Playing a video game can do so much. And being able to see it all come down to the end. Oh, man. What a what a good time. All right. That's it. I'm not going to keep going. Um, thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. This is going to be very fun to look back to in the future. Who knows what happens in the, in the next five years, ten years. But being able to come back and saying, you know, the ending of the Destiny 2 journey and just Destiny in general. So that was a good one. Thank you guys for watching. I had a great time. I hope you enjoyed my reaction. Um, and I hope all of you guys' uh, all of your guys' experience in Destiny was similar. And you felt the same uh, same joy and satisfaction that I got. But as always, stay safe, wash your hands, and spread positivity just like butter. And to be cheesy, like our ghost said, Guardians, we make our own fate. Thank you for watching. Guardian. Guardian. Eyes up, Guardian.